bio-augmentation has become commonplace throughout the developed world. The sheer scale of this disaster has overwhelmed the authorities. Superstorms continue to hammer the region, hampering relief efforts. These are uncertain times. Our future depends upon the choices we make. As populations continue to expand, megacities emerge worldwide. The extreme conditions have led to a vast exodus of displaced residents. WA bases were on high alert this morning. Direct energy air defenses neutralized the attack almost immediately. Protesters and local forces clashed again today, resulting in yet more bloodshed. Make no mistake, this is a new Cold War. We may not always see our enemies, but they are out there. My name is Jacob Hendricks. I'm your new CO. This is Egyptian Minister Saeed, taken hostage by NRC forces two days ago. After the uprisings in Cairo, they may want to make an example of him. Punish him. We're not going to let that happen. Just so we're clear, if this goes wrong, you never existed. Let's get this done! Taylor, version is in play, bird is down. Confirmed. The sentries are leaving their post to respond to the crash. Proceed to the package. Make the grab before it breaks. It has broken. We're on it. See you at the RP. Roger that. While they're busy dealing with the crash, these uniforms should allow us to slip by unnoticed. As long as we don't have to talk to anyone. So keep your mouth shut. Security stations across the way in the tunnels. Once there, we'll be able to pinpoint the minister's exact location. Heads and weapons down. Keep it cool until we make the grab. I'll follow your lead. Taylor, we're at the security station. Moving to secure. I hear you, Hendricks. Let's do this. Ready when you are. I'll kill the alarms on this floor. Get plugged in and locate the minister. Taylor, scanning for package. Waiting for a hit on facial recognition. Other hostages? I thought it was only the minister. And so did I. Poor sons of bitches. The NRC are known for their brutality. Taylor, did you know there were other prisoners? The minister is the only priority. Understood. Check the next feed. Are we just gonna leave them to be tortured? We have our orders. No match. That's him, the minister.
He's being moved. We have to find out where they're taking him. Bingo. Match confirmed. Moving to secure. ETA? Two minutes. Two minutes. I'll be timing you. Son of a bitch was never funny. You sound like the voice of experience. Trust me. I am. Cell block ahead. On me. I'll take point. You breach observation. You invaded our home. We only did what we have to do. Interrogator has his back to the door. Two sentries inside. Their guards down. You are cowards. On my mark. Three, two, go! We're here to extract you. Do as I say and you'll make it through this. What about Lieutenant Khalil and the others? Sorry, no time. Khalil was a hero of the Cairo uprising. You know that makes him a valuable asset for their propaganda. They will make an example of him. Fuck! Great, let's go! Here, this one. Get the door, I'll cover. I'll cut the poor bastard down. Minister. Khalil. Uh, Hendrix. Can you fight, Khalil? Always. We'll grab a weapon from the locker room up ahead. And reprogram it to match your biometrics. Sounds like they're finally on to us. Let's move! Taylor, package plus one, secure and inbound. Plus one, your orders were to extract the minister. His name is Lieutenant Khalil. Sound familiar? Get moving. We'll see you topside. Depot ahead will be heavily guarded. Get ready to go loud.
That's our exit. Cargo elevator up ahead. Get in the elevator. It'll take us up to the hangar. Clear out the NRC so we can get topside. If we do, trust me, we're dead. If we don't. Drop them. Move forward. Too late. Your imaginary watch is fast. Nice to see you, Jacob. You too, John. You look, you look different. You still seeing Rachel? That didn't work out. That's a pity. Mm. No blood? Gonna take, take care of him as good as you did me? That's not funny, man. We, we still set on our Xville? Charge the set. We're good, good to go, Xville in 10! Diaz, you're on babysitting duty. Let's roll! Stay close.
try and keep up, all right? That technical's mine. Give me some cover fire. Get to the bridge. I'll keep them busy. Ready's got you from here. Better hustle. Pickups five out. On me! On me! Exfil is across the bridge up ahead. They'll still be right in our ass. We've set charges all across the beach to cover our exfil. We detonate as soon as we're across the bridge. No one follows us. Those AFBs are blue gear of the Take it from here. Those other hostages we saw, you could get them out. Not a mission priority. It may not be a mission priority, but there's still people, damn it! Or have you changed so much that you've forgotten what that feels like? 
All right, change of plan. Hendrix, your team will escort the minister to the extract. We'll go back and get the hostages. More robots. Yeah, don't worry about them. We're built to handle them. Come on, get out of here, go! I got the wheel. Get on the turret.
Okay, calm down. Just relax. You're gonna be fine. You got smarter than you. Achieved our objectives. Man's always gonna be better than machine. Unfortunately, you sustained life threatening injuries. You're stable, but you got a long way to go. Who are you? It's me, Taylor. happening to you? Am I dreaming? Well, let's say you are. Why not just go with it, right? After all, you can always wake up. December 12th, 2054, 7.30 a.m. We're on board a private commuter train headed to the Zurich headquarters of the Coalescence Corporation. Our, uh, cargo. Prototype for the Winslow Accord Neural Network Initiative. At its core, specialized AI software that's capable of rewriting itself in order to interface with any other system in the world. State-of-the-art stuff back in the day. It'd go on to revolutionize a broad range of military and civilian applications. At least, it would have if the train had reached its destination. At 7.31 a.m., a terrorist group detonated an explosive device on board this train. The incident sent back our robotics program several years. You're here to stop it. This isn't real. It can't be. What's happening to me? Right now? Right now, you're in a medically induced coma being prepped for surgery. You've got a new bit of hardware inside your head. It's called a Direct Neural Interface, or DNI. I've got one too. That's how I'm able to communicate with you. Your DNI is what connects your mind with your new body and the larger world around you. We're connected. All of this is a simulation inside our minds. And you've got a long way to go. Uh. Oh, 11.30 a.m. December 11th, 2054. Zerk security forces receive an anonymous tip giving them the location of a hideout the terrorists are using. 
Unfortunately, the ZSF underestimated the firepower these assholes were packing. They got caught with their pants down, and they took it hard. Outcome? Train go boom. You remember Diaz? I think so. I'm gonna help get you up to speed on some of the cool new shit you can do. Communication. We all gotta be in sync. Yo, Taylor, you're a fucking dick. You he didn't hear shit. Talk to you, the DNI transmit. Close channel. I don't even have to think about it. But, uh, just so you know. If you ever think about calling Taylor a dick for real, he's gonna mess you up worse than those robots. Alright, let's go see if you can do this without ending up with Swiss cheese like those poor bastards. Okay, weapon hot. Mark the floor with these ass. Mobility. It may take a little getting used to, but your confidence will soon grow. Try it for yourself. I got a hundred says you can do it. Yeah, I messed up my first time too. You'll get the hang of it. Pack mode will highlight inbound threats such as rockets and grenades. You see flashing red. This out. Oh. 
threats such as rockets and grenades. You see flashing red? Move! And I doesn't just help us communicate with each other. It allows us to interact with a variety of computer systems, including pretty much all the basic drone units. Now, bipeds, sophisticated ground units, those are a whole lot trickier. Those sons of bitches got a damn hive mind. You try to process and control all that, your brain is toast. 
But these? These fuckers are easy. Go ahead. Back in. Go see what's on the other side of this wall. Fits like a glove, right? Now somewhere through there is a generator. Take it out and that door should open.
out their turrets with deception. Central console. Pull any data you can. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Just take a second. Take a deep, deep breath in. Tell, tell me what happened. I was back in Ethiopia. The grunts. I lived it all over again. What's happening to me? Shit. You know how your senses can trigger vivid memories? Make you think of sounds, sights, words from songs. Make you think of stuff you haven't thought of in years. The DNI can make that a lot more visceral. Little glitches on your optics, little whispers in your ear. This shit happens. The doctor can straighten it out. You just need to recalibrate your meds. Trust me, you're gonna be fine. What happens now? Oh, right now? You're gonna interface with that console. As soon as you plug in, you'll be able to extract and process the information in a heartbeat. Got it. They hit a man on the east at Coalescence. He would have been able to supply them with everything they needed to bypass the security on the train. Botch the assault man, it took six hours for the ZSF to get that information. Outcome? Took you just six minutes. Yeah, it would have been five. If you hadn't freaked out when you saw those robots. So, what happens now? Now we can find the son of a bitch.
Tipped off by his terrorist pals. The mole was ready for him. He had heavy duty combat grunts with him. Once again, the Zerk security force got their asses handed to him. Out come! Train go boom. We lost him. He slipped away. You remember Specialist Sarah Hall? She's gonna walk you through the next part. Trust her, do exactly what she says. I trained her myself. She's an intelligence expert from back when that actually meant something. Before DNI, you had to read books. In the Academy, Taylor made me read a lot of them. Well, some knowledge is worth earning. Appreciating. And that takes time. Time is something we don't always have. Okay, new blood. From this point on, the simulation deviates from actual events. Not that it's gonna feel any less real. Use your imagination. Sending his location to your HUD. Come on now, pick up the trail. You got potential. Our boy's hacking the ZSF talents. What does that tell you? He's running scared. Not sitting behind a computer. He could only be controlling them if he's got a DNI too. You're a smart one, new blood. I'll give you that. Son of a bitch is still moving. Billboard to get over the maglev train. Use that billboard to get over the maglev train. Train. He's heading into Old Zurich. Move. All right, activating the new cyber ability. System paralysis. Don't take him out, newbie. We need him alive. Why are you doing this old school? Use system paralysis. suspect has about 15 seconds left before he shakes hands with the Grim Reaper. You can't let that happen. Not before you get the information we need. I don't think he's in any condition to talk. He doesn't have to. He has a DNI.
Buried beneath layers of security protocols, the subject's DNI records cam footage of the user's past experiences. In extreme circumstances, it is possible to extract that information by force. You'll be able to push deep into the subject's memories, their thoughts, even their subconscious. You could learn everything we need to know about the terrorist plans. I'm sensing a butt coming up somewhere. You should know. Not only will this procedure be deeply traumatic for the subject, but the associated subconscious interference will leave him brain dead. Dead. Believe me, this is a bad way to go. He's a dead man anyway. You said it yourself. Besides, he's a fucking terrorist.